Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and welcome to the Mel Science Experiment video. Um, in this video, we will be doing the experiment, obviously. Um, so this box in front of me contains two experiments. Um, the first experiment is the tin den dendrite and the second one is the tin hedgehog. But we will be doing the tin hedgehog uh, for this video, if I can open it. And it has welcome to science in all of the languages possible. Anyway, let's um, open this thing and then we will um, switch views when we start doing the experiment. Whoa. Um, that, that's very, very cool. Uh, these are two pamphlets of the different experiments or the instructions for the experiments. This is the tin hedgehog and this is the tin dendrite. Uh, we're going to be focusing on this one though. And here are the different uh, materials that we need for the experiments. Yeah, so without further ado, let's switch the view and start the experiment. So these are the materials that we'll need for the tin hedgehog experiment. And I have the instructions which are inside of the pamphlet uh, over here. But first, I'm already wearing the goggles. I'm going to put on the gloves. Okay, so first we will prepare the tin chloride solution. Um, I'll first take these out. So this is the tin chloride and this is the sodium hydrogen sulfate. We'll first open this tin chloride. Okay. There's some powder in there. And I'll open this. First, I need to remove that stopper which is inside using this pin. So I will just push this in. I hope that did it. There you go. Now I'll pour this whole thing inside here. Bismillah. There, it's empty. We first need to add one of these tips. I'll secure the tip properly. I don't know if I'm doing this right. There. There. And I'll close this. And we shake. Okay, so now I will fill this bottle halfway, if I can open it. Okay, I just had to pop it out. And I'll fill this halfway. Okay. There. That's about enough. Oh. And I'll just close this again. So here is the zinc. Um, it comes in this cute little bottle with five pellets, I guess. Um, so I'm going to open this, take one out, and put it inside of our solution. Okay, here it is. I'll proceed to put this in, and I will close it. Bismillah. When zinc is added to the tin chloride solution, the zinc pellet reacts with the tin chloride and the following reaction occurs. This is an example of a single displacement reaction. Zinc acts as a reducing agent, giving electrons to the tin chloride so that the tin precipitates, as in, substances in it become solid and separate from the liquid or solution. 
The reaction begins at the surface of the zinc pellet, and the tint precipitates or forms into solid from the solution as beautiful crystals in a process called crystallization. As the tin metal is produced, atoms stack on top of each other in a characteristic form or allotrope of the element. The fern-like shape of the zinc crystals is a characteristic of that metal, so while other types of metal crystals may be grown using this technique, they won't display the same appearance. Thanks for watching this video. Subscribe and click on the notification bell. Like, comment, and share with friends and family.